Imagine a world where your medicines don't work as expected, or worse, contain harmful impurities. It might sound like a nightmare, but without rigorous testing and validation, this could be a reality. In fact, a study found that nearly 75% of drug recalls in the past decade were linked to analytical errors or inconsistent testing methods. So, how do we ensure that every pill, capsule, and injection is tested accurately and consistently? Welcome to the world of method validation, where science meets precision. Today, we are unraveling the mystery behind method validation, one of the most critical processes in pharmaceutical quality control. By the end of this video, you'll know why it's crucial, how it works, and what happens when it's ignored. So, what is method validation? At its core, method validation is a rigorous process that ensures that laboratory testing methods provide accurate, reliable, and consistent results. Simply put, it answers the question, can this test be trusted? Pharmaceutical companies conduct thousands of tests, from checking drug potency to detecting impurities and contaminants. If these tests aren't validated, we risk inaccurate results, which could lead to a life-saving drug failing to work, harmful side effects due to undetected impurities, costly recalls that damage reputations and patient trust. To avoid such disasters, regulators like the FDA, US Food and Drug Administration, EMA, European Medicines Agency, and India's CDSCO have strict guidelines that every pharmaceutical company must follow when validating methods. Challenges in pharmaceutical testing While method validation is essential, it's not an easy task. The pharmaceutical industry faces several challenges, including variability in results, even minor differences in lab equipment, technician skills, or environmental conditions can lead to inconsistent results, time and cost pressures, developing and validating a method can take weeks or even months, costing millions. Regulatory Compliance Companies must meet stringent regulatory standards, which keep evolving with new advancements. Complexity of testing Some pharmaceutical formulations involve multiple active ingredients, requiring highly specialized analytical techniques, risk of cutting corners, under pressure to meet deadlines. Some companies may take shortcuts, leading to serious consequences. A classic case highlighting these challenges is the Wilsartan recall in 2018, where impurities in blood pressure medications were traced back to poor analytical method validation. The recall affected millions of patients worldwide and cost companies over $1 billion in damages. Key Components of Method Validation To ensure a test is scientifically sound, method validation focuses on several key parameters. Specificity, can the method detect only the intended substance, without interference from impurities or excipients? Example, if testing for paracetamol in a tablet, the method should detect paracetamol alone, ignoring fillers, binders, or other inactive ingredients. Sensitivity, how small an amount of the substance can the test reliably detect? Example, if a test for an antibiotic can only detect large quantities but misses tiny traces, it's not sensitive enough. Accuracy, how close are the test results to the true value? Example, if a drug's label says 500 mg but tests show 450 mg, the accuracy is off. Precision, can the test produce consistent results under the same conditions? Example, if a lab runs the same test five times and gets different results each time, the method lacks precision, linearity and range. Does the test give reliable results across a wide concentration range? Example, if testing sugar levels in syrup formulations, the method should work whether the sugar concentration is low or high. Robustness and ruggedness, can the method still work if conditions change slightly? Example, if different labs, analysts, or slightly different temperatures affect the results, the method isn't robust. By balancing these factors, pharmaceutical companies can develop highly reliable and reproducible testing methods. Real-world consequences of poor method validation Let's take a real case where inadequate method validation had devastating consequences. A pharmaceutical company once launched a new drug for a rare genetic disorder. However, due to a poorly validated testing method, the data submitted to regulators was inaccurate. The drug was approved but later found to be ineffective. The result, a massive recall, lawsuits, and patient suffering, millions of dollars in losses, a tarnished reputation for the company, this is why method validation is not just a regulatory requirement, it's a moral responsibility to ensure public safety. Today, we've explored what method validation is and why it matters, the biggest challenges faced in pharmaceutical testing, the key parameters that determine a test's reliability, the severe consequences of poor method validation, 
the pharmaceutical industry cannot afford mistakes, and method validation is our best safeguard against them. Now, I'd love to hear from you. Have you encountered method validation in your work or studies? What challenges do you think are the toughest? Drop a comment below. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more insights into pharma and healthcare. Thanks for watching Pharma Health Insights with Rajesh. Until next time, stay informed and stay safe.